Hey guys, what's up? Um, Master Chief here. Um, I just got back from my uh, game day. Um, did pretty good. I got in uh, seventh, and I got the uh, Crip on Horror, all that stuff. But um, anyway, uh, this I also when I got back home, uh, I saw in my mailbox. Uh, I got uh, my trade confirmation or my trade from uh, Ramiko and so I'm gonna do that but um first I wanted to show you guys this what it's a new playmat it's for my dragon deck obviously you can see there <laughs> Maybe I have to do that anyway so um, I believe this is the trade here some knife. This is a new knife I got. And now I know which way the blade is. <laughs> Thumbs up if you know where that came from. <laughs> um, anyway, so here I, I believe this is the trade because I think I traded for a mimic vat. I could be completely wrong. Um, so mimic vat, kitchen finks. Yeah, this is the trade. Uh, two steam vents, awesome. Uh, and three champion of the pariah, and two niv magnus elementals, which means I forgot I was trading for two of those. Um, which is awesome. So now I have five. So one of those is for trade for peoples, and these I believe are extras. So we got his signed land, a guild feud for Fireman's Foresight, Counterlash, a Archwing Dragon, a Furyborn Hellkite, awesome, Balefire Dragon, and another Balefire Dragon. Sweet. So, that's awesome. Especially this Fearborn Hellkite. I never got one of those. So, that'll be going in my Dragon EDH deck. Um, anyway, thanks for the trade, Romiko. Uh, can't wait for the next trade with you. He's a safe trader, guys. Um, we found a deal pretty fast. Um, his link, the link to his channel will be below. Um, anyway, on to the next Matter. Can I put that there? That's still man. Uh So I'm gonna do a detailed trade binder update because I have traded for a lot. Whoa! I slid that all around. Ugh. Put this knife away before someone gets stabbed. Um. Ugh. There. Okay. So. This is gonna be an a complete updated trade binder. Um, a and get my my dragon deck out. I thought I'd go over this since it was game day. Um, by the way, um, this is my box that I got my uh, uh, EDH. Um, starter deck in, and the dragon sleeves are pretty good. I ended up getting uh, four extra, so at least I didn't get four or less. But so that's kind of good. They're pretty good sleeves, I would say, um, especially if you want to get a whole bunch at a time. But um, I think I'm going to really quickly just kind of go through my deck. It's not organized because I just got back from game day, but I can tell you what is in there. So, for the sideboard we have three dragon tokens, magma quake for like planeswalker decks, two redirects for people that are just like running dread bore, or not dread bore, for uh, abrupt decay, like that kind of thing. Um, Tormund's Crypt for, you know, uh, Graph Digger's Grave and Witchbane Orb for those kind of decks. Uh, Devastation Tide, uh, to bounce things, to, I would swap Devastation Tide in for, uh... 
what's it called, uh, Cyclonic Rift, uh, two Archering Dragons if I need them, uh, Brimstone Volley if I need more, um, uh, uh, what's it called, oh, there's another Magma Quake, if I need more, um, Burn, um, Balefire Dragon for just a different dragon, Clone, uh, to take out, uh, um, cackling counterpart if I'm playing like a super aggro deck and they I don't have time to play anything. Um, dispel for more counters and thought scour for draw. That I took thought scour out recently. I'm gonna replace that with something else, but you'll see what I replaced it with. All right, in my deck we have four Utvara Hellkites, um, one cackling counterpart, one divination or two divinations, one dispel. Two hypersonic dragons. Let's see if I can get this zoomed in a little bit more. There you go. Um, two syncopates, two cyclonic rifts, two niv uh, four dragon hatchlings, four thundermall hellkites, four slumbering dragons, one Russian, two infernal plunge, two temporal masteries. I put this in, two of these in. Well, one, because no one was trading for them, so these are for trade if you want them, like, bad enough, but, um, it actually worked pretty well. I got a Miracle it twice, and I hard casted it once, and it's nice just because this deck is kind of slow, so it just gives me another turn to go ahead and do more stuff and maybe get, like, an extra land out there. I believe I'm running eight mountains and five, five islands, uh, four Sulphur Falls. Two steam vents. I got two more, so I'm probably gonna put those in. Um, going one cavern of souls. I already set all this. Four called a kindred, which is the main part of the deck. Two bonfires for damage, which I would swap a bonfire out for magma quake if they're playing like planeswalkers, and I need to hit all their planeswalkers. Two museum mortars. And I think that's everything in this deck. Um, it played really well. Um, first game I completely crushed a guy. Um, 2-0. He didn't have an amazing deck though. But um, second game I went one and two. Um, I just made a bad call on the first game. I kept a hand, and it had two mana, and I was like. Well, I'll probably be fine. I had two summoning dragons. Then, never got a single mana after that, and I completely lost the first game. The second game, I crushed him, and but then the third game, it was really close. But um, he was able to pull ahead, which kind of sucks because I probably could have done something. Um, also, I played like the first deck was supposed to be a control deck, but it really didn't control at all. The Second deck was Heavy Control, Terminus, completely raped, um, especially when I didn't have a counter spell, or if only I had, like, redirect. Um, uh, third deck I played, what was that against? Oh, that was a 2-1 game as well. He was, I beat him... No, he beat me first game. He was a Rancor guy. He was Rancoring, and he beat me first game because he hit me for so much. The second game, I kept him from doing anything, and I just kept swinging over him and destroyed him. The third game it ended up being like 7-2, and two, but because I allowed... There was one mistake that I made earlier in the game that made me take 5 damage. I could have prevented that if I had a, like, counter, uh, uh, returned him to hit his hand with Cyclonic Rift. So... That sucks, um, and I was able, I could have maybe won, but he had, uh, an Azorius Charm to pump it up. I think it was Azorius Charm, that's what that does, I think. There's one, I think that's one of them. Um, zoom out a little bit for this. Um, sorry, there's a window right there. Can I, so, alright, I'll just tell you what's, maybe, I don't know. Um. Oh, can I zoom out enough for you to see that? Alright, you can sort of see that. 
Alright. Um, anyway, um, so, and then the third game, he got to use his rank, uh, oh yeah, I just told you about the third game, the third game was really close. Um, uh, the last game, it was a draw, 1-1-1, one, one, one. uh, he was playing mill, and the first game he just milled me out, like, cause he got his mill land out, and he was just milling me for three, and I just couldn't get my fifth land until I had, like, 18 cards left, was when I finally got my fifth land. And then I could play Thunder Maul. I had like three Thunder Mauls in my hand, so I kept playing them. Um, but then he also had, he could put stuff on top of my library. He eventually milled me out for a game. Um, I never got like a Temporal Mastery, which I was hoping for I'd get, but I never got one to use against him. Um, on that game, at least. Second game, I completely crushed him. I was able to use Temporal Mastery and get another, get two dragons out. Um, oh yeah, I forgot. Okay. Um... Second game I played with that deck, um, the first round, I had two, no, s third game I played, uh, the one that I lost, the first one I lost, I had two, um, Call to Kindreds out, and a whole, I have 20 dragon cards in my deck, which means a third of my deck is dragons, one turn, both of them didn't give me any dragons at all. Luckily, I drew a Thunder Maul after that, but I didn't get one dragon for a whole turn. The second turn, I didn't get one the first one, and I got one the second one, but then he removed one. Then the next time, skipped out, and then he removed that. And I, It was probably the most unlucky play I could have had in this. Um, uh... Trying to figure out. I don't know. Um. If I pull it this way. Yeah. If I, it looks like if I pull it this way and then angle you guys down. Can I avoid the glare? Alright. That's as best as I can do, I think. Okay, um, so, yeah, and then the third game, I pl or the fourth game, the last game we played, um, it was a draw, we went to turns, and we both couldn't do anything, um, he kept putting my niv on top of my library, I had gotten rid of all his stuff, and I probably could have won if we had infinite time, um, cause he used his last charm or whatever it was to put the thing on top, I forgot which spell it was, but... Um, so that kind of sucks, but, um, anyway, I still got 7th, so, um, so still 3% Captain, Spoils, or it's just a car, Martial Law, um, for Black and Ravnica, we have, Ravnica, the Pack Rat, Grave Betrayal, um, Underworld Connections, um, Green, Wild Beast Master, Promo, Deadbridge Goliath, Foil, uh, uh, Druid's Deliverance, Mana Bloom, um, three Guild Feuds, Chaos Imps, times two, Foil Surfei the Wreckage, um, Search the City, Sphinx of Chimes, Sphinx of Chimes, Conjure Currency, two, voil, two Foil Voltic Rigs, or Volatile Rigs, and two Normal, do that one today, Foil Tablet of the Guilds, two Epic Experiments, two Lawful Trolls, Righteous Authority, two Fire Minds Foresight, Two hypersonic dragons. Actually, I think I have four. Just I forgot to put stuff in the deck in this again. Havoc Festival, Slaughter Games, Collective Blessings, uh, two Wayfaring Temple, two Growing Ranks, two Archon of the Trumvirates, one promo. The other one's behind it. I drew that today as well. Uh, Corpse Track Menace, Draws Orders, Nith Mazette, Spoil Search Warrant. Um, Azorus Electors and Foil Hellhole Flailer, um, three Niv Magnus Elementals, two Counterflux, one Foil Niv Mazette the Fireman from the Dual Decks. This is not for trade because this is going to be my Dragon General because um, I like it better than the normal one. I don't know why. I want to combo them together <laughs> uh, just because it would be funny. And a Tristani, which I pulled today. That's for trade as well. Um, 
over here we got uh, Angelic Overseer. I traded my Ajani. I still have another one, possibly for trade, and um, two Sublime Archangels, possibly for trade, if you can get them off me. Uh, Blade Splicer, four champion, of, well, one champion of the parish, but I have, I just got like a whole bunch, I think, right? But I think I'm going to use him. Yeah, one champion of the parish, two seance, I think. Micaeus Lunark, three sudden disappearance, restoration angel. Uh, promo, Silver Blade Paladin, Kathos Crusade times two or something, Rider's Cabinet times two, Nevermore, Angel Alabaster, Geist Honored Monk, uh, Dearly Departed, Two Odric Master Ca Tactician, Face Reward, Captain of the Watch, Draven Doom Slayer, I think times two. Oh, Angel's Glory Rise, several O Rings, uh, Herald of the War, um, Increasing Devotion, Angelic Arbiter, Three White Sun Zeniths, Deathless Angel, a uh, foil white, stony silence, two banishing stroke, uh, foil gavinry, iron right, curse of exhaustion, a race, divine favor, three been valiant. Oh, um, foil Ogrod, inquisitor, silver claw, or silver claw griffin, and aquarium angel. Black, uh, another underworld connections, flattery lich, uh, Liliana emblem, um. Uh, Descent into Madness, times two. Reaper the Best, I think, times two. McKay's Lunark, times two. Two Shimmy Inspectors, this one's foil. Two Mutilates, I think I'm gonna use them, but I'll go ahead and trade. Uh, uh, Scurs Dag, High Priest. Nephrox, Blood Gift Demon, times two. Another, uh, Unbreathing Horde. Uh, Ad Nauseum, Increasing Ambition. Two Curse of Misfortunes, two Raven Stevens. Uh, Zombie Apocalypse, I think, times two. Maybe. Um, two Xathra Gorgons. A Curse of Death's Hold. Oh, I should see this word. <clears throat> Ugh, sorry. Two Heartless Summonings. Two endless, or four Endless Ranks of the Dead. I traded for two today. I'm thinking of making like... Well, one my friend has Zombies deck. I'm thinking of making Zombies or put, putting Zombies in my Demon deck or my Red Black Demon Vampire deck. I'm... Um, Kind of deciding on that. I just kind of want to know him for a trade. The guy needed some planeswalkers that I've been trying to get rid of, so just went for him. Um, and these were just kind of filler ins. Um, Exquisite Blood, Demon Lord of Ashmouth, Two Army of the Damned. Also thinking. Um, Fiend of the Shadows, Dark Imposter, Gold Raz Assassin, um, Lil Line of the Void, Dismember, Foil Organ Grinder. Probably not for trade. Um, anyway, foil, exquisite blood, foil, gruesome. These are all foils. Uh, gruesome encore, veilborn ghoul, ghoul caller's chant, driver of the dead, um, death's caress, blood seeker, um, mark of the vampire, grave purge, and drag down, green, two essence of the wild, uh, prior's council. Two deranged outcasts, two thrag or thrag tusks, red predators rampage, two Elvis arch druids plus others just not in here. Feed the pack, two lost in the woods, champion of Lambolt, plus a uh, Korean one in the back. Four of these, these I'm thinking I'm putting in a deck. I'll talk a little bit about it later. Um, I got my others. Um, two revenge of the haunted. I think I have a Korean one too. Splinter fright. Um, daybreak ranger. Uh, Unvalled Tracker, Soul Harvest, Slash, uh, Silk Lash Spider, Increasing Savagery, Jewage Repository, Foiled, uh, Foiled Range Outcast, Bremble Crush, Vorse Claw, Amber Bush Viper, Wandering Wolf, Sylvan Ranger. You can notice a couple of things have been traded for. Foil, Cough of the Hammer, uh, Flare of the Hate Bound, Hound Grizzle Brand. I think I have multiples if you want more. Two Reforge the Soul, Urbach the hit, Hidden Bonfire. If you don't care about the condition, I have a slightly. I have a played bonfire. I'm not even going to say slightly played. It's a played bonfire. If you do not care, I would rather trade that because I. I mean, I like it, but I don't care as much as the next guy. But. Anyway, Malignus, Inferno Titan, Curse of Stock Prey, times a couple. Uh, I think I have four. Two Archwing Dragons, several Held Riders. Um, moon, Korean Moon Veil, two Tyrant Discords, I think two Charm Breakers, but maybe only one. Heretic's Punishment, Reverberate, Alpha Brawl, 
two mana barbs, two Markov Blade Masters, two Falcon Reef Marauders, two Firing Phoenix, two Fervor. Um, this is kind of like a goblin deck, like I said before. Uh, two Hammer Back Goliath. Um, two Krinko's Command, or four Krinko's Command, four Goblin Chieftains. Um, so those card, those three cards that I just told you about, um, may not be for trade, but you can offer. I may um, go for that. Um, anyway, two Red Sun Zeniths, I think. Slag Storm, Blood Hall Ooze, um, Metal Appeal, Galvanoth, um, Gutshot Tybalt. Traded both my Chandras, evidently. Uh, the other guy, I'll show you what I traded for, but uh, anyway. Full of Falcon Wreath Marauders, Kessler Kamal Conants, Into the Core, Tormented Pariah, Harvest Pyre, Krinko's Command, Torch Fiend, Melt Terrain. Oh, uh, blue, wow. I traded all this stuff today in blue. Anyway. Two Mirror Mad Phantasms, Bellagore of Wills. Finally got rid of the Omni Science, which no one else wanted, so kind of happy about that. Kind of sucks, but it was 20 when I pulled it, now it's like a lot less, so. Fine with that. He was making an EDH and he wanted it. Anyway, so Spell Twine, Battle of Wits, Storm's Die to Levi Leviathan, Distant Memories, uh, Friction, Instigator. Yeah. Wait. Yeah. Just making sure I didn't have multiples. Um, Dungeon Geists, Heaven Goal, Rune Binder, Rune, yeah, Rune Binder uh, Visions of the Beyond, Lunar Mystic, Back from the Brink, Sphinx of the Thune, Ludifer's Test, Subject, Spirit Away. Two Void Stalker, two Stolen Goods, Counter Lash, uh, two Curse of Echoes, uh, two Girl of Mind Crushers, Arcane Melee, Foil Blue, right? Yeah, Foil Blue, Murder of Crows, Peel from Reality, Encrust, uh, Controlled Instincts, Argent Sphinx, and uh, Keterict Leviathan, uh, Artifacts. Elris Mining Blade, Beast of Burden, two Hell Vaults, two Door of Nothingness. How many Chromatic Lanterns do I have in? I have two Chromatic Lanterns in here. I think I have three. Um, Stuffy Doll times two, one from Time Spiral. Druidic Satchel. The one from Time Spiral is kind of beat up. Um, I got it from a friend, but anyway. Um, two Torpor Orbs. The other one's over here. Um, uh, Unwinding Clock. Gilded Lotus, um, I think I, I can't, I might trade it, I think I need it for my EDH deck though, because I traded my foil one, and I don't think I have another non-foil, because I traded my other non-foil the other time, yeah, the other day, so, Sansa Delirium, I'll make an offer for that, but, if anyone has a foil Gilded Lotus, I kind of want it, um, throw it in as an extra, or we might put it in a trade to fill value, um, because I think it looks really cool, and I traded mine just because I really needed the stuff, and he gave me, like, a couple bucks in value anyway, so. Sands of the Delirium, I think times two. Maybe, no, one, I traded one. Manor Gargoyle, I think I might have another. Two Mirror Battle Spheres, the other one's over here. Staff of Nin, a couple of those. Uh, so also the promo ones, if you need the promo ones. Um, Mirror Works, just got mim Mimic that, which will be fun. Um, Creepy Doll, Moon Silver Spear, I have others. Um, if you remember, the video before this, it'll be in the description, I showed you a stack of cards. All of those are still there, um, so you can go look there as well. I don't have those in the area right now, so I'm not going to get them. But those are all still for trade. I didn't bring those with me, so all of those cards are still in the uh, in trade mode. So look at that um, in the video in the below, or you can look up at my videos that I've made. Um, anyway, uh, Otherworld Atlas, Gallows of the Wills, Trading Post, Etch Champion, and a Chimeratic Mass, I believe. Um, Foil, Chalice, same thing like I said last time. Oh, I didn't trade a Johnny, they just put it, oh yeah, he couldn't build up enough value. So, a Johnny's still there, don't worry, Johnny, still there. <laughs> I think someone else I'm talking to, I think, uh... Someone else I was talking to wanted that, so I'm glad that's still there. Um, anyway, uh, Executioner's Hood, Blazing Torch, Demon's Horn, Dragon's Claw, uh, Ghoul Caller's Bell, two Nicobolus, one Sigarda. I tried to get another because I have several people. Only one person, one of you guys, has wanted Sigarda, 
but um no two of you guys but I'm trading it to someone else um and but several people at the place have wanted one I tried to get one but the guys like oh I want to keep all four power five girls I'm like, fine having a lich I got that today two drug skull reavers got that today walking reaver aristocrat my deck is not built yet but I want her I I want two of her in the deck I think I might not be able to maybe one is all I'm gonna have um I traded my other one uh for value um but I'll show that um steward uh foil steward Val valoron whatever evil twin deadshot minotaur the these are foil by the way deadshot minotaur male fire wings giant ambush beetle death duelist several emma wolves these aren't foil um and a foil Lee of sky knight um over here now these are what I tra I got today. I got two dreadboards from one guy, and I got this from one of the guys that I traded the uh, uh what it's what's it called a uh, falconry for aristocrat plus some other stuff. Foil dreadboard is for trade, but you have to throw in a normal dreadboard. Um, and then there's the foil game day promo, uh, Cryptborn horror, pretty cool. Um, over here we got. Two Drown Catacombs, Contested War Zone, uh, Tectonic Edge. Over on the back, we have two Hellion Crucibles with the Hellion Counter, three Gavinry, no, two Gavinry Townships. Um, I traded that and this stuff. Uh, Stenza Blood Hall, uh, Raging Ravine, uh, three Reliquary tower Towers. This one's foil, I believe. Yeah, that one's foil. Now, these are for Hinterland Harbors. These are not for trade. These are for my Dragon deck, which I am thinking of splashing green in for Descendant's Path. Maybe a mana ramp or two, or a, a counter ramp, but probably not. Probably just for Descendant's Path. I'm thinking about how to add that in, but I needed four of them, so I could have at least... I might end up only using two, because I have four... Um, Rootbound Crags, and I might just put two Rootbound Crags and two Hinterland Harbor to keep like the mana equal, but I haven't decided exactly yet, so these aren't for trade. Make an offer, and I may, by the time you make an offer, I may have something uh, to be like, yeah. Um, here's my red black binder, so still one Rakdos return, four Ash Zillots, one Olivia. Uh, this is my deck, sorry, not binder, red black deck. Um, Grizzlebrand, four. Des uh, Desecration Demons, Nephrox, Harvester Souls. This isn't like the whole deck, it's just kind of like I'm working on it. Um, you guys can throw in some, uh, uh, some, um, suggestions if you want. Um, two Disciple Bolas, so I got that off my list. Two Killing Waves, Rakdos, which I got today, which was from what, the guy with the Falcon Wreath. I forgot, anyway. Four Strong Kirks, I traded. I already had one. I got two from one guy and one from the other guy that I got the other stuff from, um, from the uh, uh, the lands from, and a world fire which I got from the guy who gave the Rakdos and everything. Um, on the back, foil, Ravenica swamp. Um, two promo Xathered Gorgons, Dried Militant. Unfortunately, I traded my Forbidden Alchemy. Alchemy, I tried to not trade it, but the guy, that was the one thing the guy needed in the whole trade. He was getting the other stuff because he knew other people that wanted it. So I ended up trading it. So if you guys have a promo Forbidden Alchemy, because I, I want to have at least one promo, I think. Um, I want to trade for that or throw that in as an extra. Also a promo Evolving Wilds would be nice because I traded both of those because two guys wanted it and I had to throw it in because I needed the stuff more. Um, anyway, so those would be awesome extras if you guys threw that in because I'm... I want to try and collect at least one promo of everything. So, with that in mind, uh, try and... Uh, I can trade at least one of these. I can probably trade more because I can probably get more from other people. But anyway, two Zathrid Gorgons, Ravenous Demon, Nef uh, Netherheart Stalker, two Technotic Edge. And I had one before, so these two are for trade. Or one of the other ones, whatever. Um, Splinter Fright, I think. These are Splinter Fright. Champion of the... Uh, 
Champion of Lambolt, which I told these are the Korean ones I told you about earlier, and Revenge of the Haunted, maybe. Uh, I actually might use that, but if you want it, I have plenty of the normal, so if you want it, I could maybe trade that. This is all Korean stuff, by the way. Um, and more Korean stuff. I can't. There you go. More Korean stuff. Anyway, uh, you guys sent it. Um, Gloom Surgeon. I got two more, so working on my page. Uh, still got these, Ugh, these, and in the rings. So that's my trade binder. Check out the uh, links below. You'll see my dragon deck and my work in progress splashing green right now. All it is is just green lands and the descendants path, and then I'm just I haven't put other stuff in. Um, I'd like your um, also, oh, um, I'd like your opinion on my dragon deck below. I know this video is running long, so I'm going to cut it short. I mean, I'm going to end it soon. Um, but I'd like your, uh, opinion on, uh, what, how I can get, like, enchantment removal in this deck without splashing another color. Um, there's probably some kind of card. I don't know. Maybe if I splash green, I can put in, uh, Slendering Growth or something like that. Uh, I can't remember if Is It Charm does it. I could look at that. That I might want to put that in there. Um, anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and thanks for watching. Peace.